Hello everybody and welcome back to Fenton Forest Farm with me, See What Eso, here on what is a reassuring day that the world is still here, the farm is still here when I reach morning, because today the official 1.3 patch of the game was released, it has been downloaded and installed, and um, so far Everything still seems to be okay, from what I can visually see. Obviously, I don't know how things are performing under the hood, so to speak, and I don't know if I've got any mod incompatibilities or anything like that caused by the new patch update, whether it's broken anything, and I'd be more likely thinking about... Um, Script mods. Why is that spawning a second row there? Hmm, interesting. No, there's noticed the manure do that before. Um, but yeah, I think looks to still be here. All my equipment still looks to be here. Nice. I don't think we've lost any vehicles or anything, so that's okay. So I'm more concerned about whether there's any script changes or anything and any of my scripting mods get broken but anyway we can discover that as we go on right let's have a look then farm wise we've got corn planted over there grass planted there sugar beets there uh, canola there potatoes there bit of wheat on field 5 Everything should be growing nice and steadily, although the grass now wants to be harvested on field 10 and also possibly on field 8. Um, after have a look into that, see how all that pans out. I did grass mowing obviously yesterday in yesterday's video because obviously we decided to fill the BGA up with quite a lot of um, silage. And again, hopefully all the prices still look pretty decent today. Although the BGA seems to be, yeah, BGA is okay. It's not quite as competitive on some stuff. Although liquid manure it's okay for. Um, reinstalled Stevie's mod. The, the map chip sales uh, heating plant prices are up and down all the time there uh, that's I don't think that's all right I think everything there's still working fine all my vehicles are fine I made a little bit of money from income how's the pigs looking the pigs are looking like they're getting ready to have the uh, Okay, the chickens could do with some wheat and barley, I would think. Got a few horses ready to sell at the end of the week, but I'll hang on and see if we can get some more. So, cows need some straw. Uh, pigs need a bit of straw. Right, all the wagon then. Right, so I need the JCB, which is still parked down here. I also need to get some, obviously get some water, trying to get some of the animals fed it and that sort of stuff. JCB's over here. Ah, tanker's over there, perfect. So I can use that to get the water in. Nice full load of uh, wool over there. Uh, I, I did kind of just move the egg pallets out of the way <laughs> so I can uh, sell them a little bit later on don't really need all wheel steering for this but if I get the auger wagon loaded up it should already have straw in it I think yes it does very nice 
Oh, well, one more thing to check very quickly. If I go into the garage. Uh, let's click on my... They should have icons for everything now because I've been in and fixed everything. So we've got water, milk, liquid fertilizer, slurry, digestate, herbicide, diesel, death, lime, fertilizer, seeds, and pig food on those. So those are all working okay. Where's the grain? Where's the trailer? That looks to be all working okay as well. Obviously I don't have... Do I have a cedar anywhere? Hard to check with one of them. Planter, cedar. Um, quickest way to check would be to go into uh, forestry equipment, I think. Yeah, we've got icons now, look, for the poplars and trees. And we should have... Okay, logs don't apparently have an icon. So even though I've put a thing in for logs, it doesn't show up as there is nothing that says logs. That's fine. All seems to be working okay. I'll tell you what, it's scary when they update the game because I just think to myself with how many mods I'm using and have installed, it could just completely and utterly break my game. And the last thing I want is to have the game break at this stage when I've already put um, 56 hours into this save. I know there's only been, what, 30... This is episode 35. So there's been about 35 hours of actual video, but I've been playing for 56. So I've played quite a bit off camera as well, doing bits and bobs, getting stuff ready, cutting out some of the... The more boring, mundane tasks. So it's um, it would be a shame if the patch had released broke the game because I'd have just cried because I'd be like, I don't want to restart. I don't want to, you know, have to start from scratch again. Definitely going to be interesting to see if I run into any issues um, with mods and that that require updating or whatever. Because I don't know where I, I, I lose track of where I download all my mods from. <laughs> So I'm not going to know if any get updated or need to be updated. We still have 22,832 litres of straw in this thing. I can't be jiggling about trying to get stuff into the uh, auger wagon. Sell some in here. It's a wheat for the chickens, don't we? <clears throat> uh, I'm going to let the pigs run out of food, I think. Uh, sheep are okay. Cows are definitely okay. Horses are okay. So it is literally just the chickens that need some wheat. Right. Or some barley. give them a bit of barley. I'm not going to give them a lot because I don't think they eat that much. I 
Are you full? Yeah. Oh, you see, they don't eat that much. Uh, a little dribble in there. I'll give it to the pigs. I know we're trying to run the pigs down, but... It saves mucking about trying to load that into the... Uh, the hopper again. Put it back in the shed, then I'll use the big tanker to go get some water. So I don't really know what the official um, update 1.3 adds to the game. I did try reading the change log, but it, it fa fails to mention a lot of stuff. There's like a whole thing about various e vehicle and equipment fixes, blah de blah de blah de blah de blah 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 blah. But then it doesn't go into any details on what all those are. So um, I don't know. There's a lot of stuff to do with multiplayer, which doesn't really affect me because I don't do multiplayer um, really I did launch a server I, I did host a dedicated server a couple of weeks back on the Jones dairy farm which I was streaming on Twitch and um, offered people the opportunity to uh, come join me on the server if they wanted to play along I even had the uh, the mod pack linked um, but you know what nobody did <laughs> so I've kind of st stopped running the server for now because I was just basically playing on that huge map all by myself which wasn't a great deal of fun <laughs> so I don't know perhaps multiplayer is not for me because I don't know enough people who like to play this game none of my actual real life friends play this game in fact, they really only just play, is it Dead by Daylight these days? That seems to be the only game they ever play when I look on Steam. Um, which I don't play because it's multiplayer only game. <laughs> you play with other random people and I don't like that. I'm not an online gamer, multiplayer gamer normally. I don't like random people, that's the problem. <laughs> I, don't, I, I don't know enough real people. Hence why I'm kind of sticking to farming sim. One of the things I did do last night, and hence why this video was started recording a little bit late this morning, because it's 11 o'clock, I was up till 5 a.m. this morning. I was awake till 5 a.m. playing on the PS4 to get my platinum trophy. Oh yes, I have now platinum the game, not only on PC, but I've also done it on um, PS4. It took me 56 hours on one single save. About the same length of time as I've put into this series. <laughs> yeah, about the same length of time as I've spent on this save game. I've put, I had to put in on the PS4 to get my platinum, but I got it last night. I thought I'd best get it done before the patch come out and before they release the DLC, just in case they add a load more um, trophies. Because <laughs> to be honest, I'm, I'm kind of I'm kind of done with the console version of the game because the mods, it's basically in the mod situation. The mods just aren't exciting or in any way riveting on the console <clears throat> to warrant me playing. We're not getting the, you know, the, the 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 number of mods that PC is getting via the official mod hub or the you know unofficial mod sites. Um, in fact, a lot of the mods that were released yesterday on the PS4, we had already had released on PS on the PC a couple of weeks ago because when I logged in on PC, it asked me to update those mods when I went to download them. Right. Oh, so it's putting in another... That's weird.
doing that with the horses. Is he doing it with the pigs as well? Whoa. That's got to be a new aspect of patch 1.3, hasn't it? I mean, no spot on like that. How much have we got? 101,000 litres. Wow. <clears throat> I possibly need to get that emptied. <clears throat> I don't know, 23,000 litres at the cows? It look, certainly looked like we've got a lot more to me. Um, right, I'm going to go get the Roadrunner. Because that's going to take quite a bit of empty. 101,000 odd litres. Oh. That's got to be a 1.3 update because I certainly haven't seen that do that before today. Unless they've changed something, so I need to probably empty the pits. Get under there, good. Hundred and one thousand litres of the big brown mucky stuff. Might have a run up to the BGA and deliver it. <laughs> Here you go, BGA. Welcome to the poop deck. Oh, careful. I should get most of that. That's it, we'll get all of that. Oh, gone too far. Seems to be does seem to be spawning it in rows, doesn't it? Difficulty getting my head round the. Uh... Why is there a lump there? Move that. The 
then I'll spot a smoothage. percent full so we're gonna go for a run up to the BGA deliver this generate a bit of income for ourselves and I could store it there I think I'm, I'm, I'm doing kind of okay for manure at the minute I've got some some slurry to uh, dispatch of or dispose of. The BGA prices should be fixed as well in this update so they shouldn't be locked to like the um what you call it um uh hard economy setting on whichever farm mode you've started on that could explain why the prices are a little bit different today as well get paid out properly bit of uh, manure gone in there and a silo but that's silage I did remember to return the least class and the um, leveler I will look into making those a, a permanent purchase at some point possibly because they did a great job of that overtake you because I need to get back to the farm quite quickly and uh, uh, sugar beets are going to be ready to harvest a couple of days probably One of the things we're supposed to be able to do now, and I haven't actually checked it, I probably should do. If I go in here, we should be able to plant like grass grass, shouldn't we? That actually like grows. I have to have an inspect of that feature. Make sure probably do with using it on the old family farm map because that's the one that um, um, where I've done the most terraforming and terrain modifying so far awesome you know, there for a little while not planning on moving that So yeah, there's 
pigs just need some stuff. Everyone else is quite happy. Horses are quite happy, so you don't have to worry about them. Say everything's growing. Uh, the corn. So what we're gonna? They're gonna be ready tomorrow. As will the potatoes. As will probably the corn. Uh, growth control. I. Ouch. Not too close to the lamppost. How's growth control looking? Yes, growth control still seems to be working, or at least the hood does. Right. So at this point, 26 minutes into the video, I'm thinking I might as well pause and bring you guys back tomorrow because there's not a lot else to do today on the farm at this point in time um, I might carry on off camera do some mowing get a course planned for um, field 10 that's probably a good idea so I'll bring you guys back in a little while Okay, everybody, welcome back. I have managed to get field 10 mode. I've got it bailed. And I'm now just wrapping the bales. Head of. Um, collecting them up, taking them to the BGA, getting them sold. Drive around, make sure I've picked up all the grass bales. I think I have. One over here. Back here in the middle. In dark. That's what happens when you have it on eight times normal speed. I thought I'd met the uh, square wrapper purple, so I can easily see the bales. Oh, that up. Oh, not going to need that anymore. Park him over here. Grab me auto load trailer. Attached to our road runner. Oh, I can get 39 square bales. I've got the obviously the one odd straw bale in there, which I can't really do anything about. get all of these sold to the BGA tonight that will then process and then we'll get paid in the morning <laughs> that'll be nice Six bales is that very handy. Stay where you are, mister. I'm coming out. Oh, 
of things I'm going to have to do is drop this, drop these bales onto this trailer, but I'll do it once I get in here. Because if I don't, um, the weight will go funny on the trailer, and then when I turn a corner, I'm probably likely to tip over. Right, so we'll do the... That's out the back, that's out that side, that's on there. Strap them on now, so they don't go wandering. And over here, it should sell them. Yeah, boy! <laughs> Something I would like to see in a future uh, map update, Stevie. If you're watching, make these doors so you can open them. Because then you could use this as a storage shelter, couldn't you? You could use this as like a storage shed. Put some lights in it, Stevie. And. Uh, We could be on happy days. Dark. <laughs> Through the day quite quickly, because obviously I want to get to the harvesting of the sugar beets and stuff. Get the tractor shifted back to the the field but i can do that that's not a problem i just wanted to show you guys how the baling the mowing on field 10 went and how many bales we were likely to get when i mow you know 30 bales it's not bad like i say there will be hay bales they might just be plain old grass bales. I did those as silage because obviously I was taking them to the BGA, so I wanted to get paid out the best price I could get. And the BGA seems to be paying the best price for the. Uh... I lost them here. I'm waiting for these to fill in. Oh! Okay. Didn't necessarily mean for that to happen. Let's get rid of that one as well. <sighs> I was going to push them out of the way like um, that stack there. And then I could have picked them all up on Friday sale day. But I goofed up there. I tripped over the... Uh, Tripped over the pallet and launched it into the air. <laughs> right. I'll get the tractors put away. The rest of the equipment. And then I'll bring you guys back in the morning where we can start hopefully doing some harvesting. <laughs> 